Hey everyone, welcome back to Strategic Command World War One. This is the Wargaming Guy, and this is my playthrough of the game from the Central Power side. It's called Before the Leaves Fall. So let's go ahead and drop our reinforcements here for the Germans. <clears throat> and the Ottomans get one. Okay, well, uh, you know, I think I'll put it right here so they can get railed down to Africa, which is where we will start as usual. Now, we had a little incursion over here, and Tripoli fell to, I guess, the French. Um, so maybe as soon as we can clean up the British here, if we can do that fairly quickly, we can uh, take a shot at getting over there. Hey, that's what I was afraid of. Yikes! Woo! It's still bad, still horrible, still terrible. However, that's pretty good. Um, yeah, you're not good either. Yeah, my, my little easy time that I had here for a little while is gone, I'm afraid. And there we go. Okay, so we're going to swing over here. See if we can't start to chase him off. Um... gang up on him. This guy has two ports. Whoa. Do I have any other ships? Any other ships? I do have a ship. Can I make him go faster? Yes, I can. He'll come down here and hopefully wear on his supply a bit. Um, so are you. Because that's more important right now than just messing around. Um, boom! He's gone. All right, good. That's what we want. We're gonna surround this guy and cover him with forces. And hopefully next turn he'll be ready. We'll we'll shell him some, and that will. Uh... Oh, he can't go any further. Really. Can you? No, you can't, but you will. Okay, everything down here is fine. Uh, right, so that's all done. Whoop, whoa. Uh, we finished off Romania. They're gone. Uh, let's check and see. Do we have partisans in Romania? We do not. That is awesome. So we can send some guys places if we decide we want or need to. That's good to know. Uh, let's bring you in here. It's, in fact, let's bring you in here. Okay, so... Um, I can't believe the Marines are here. But they are. And they are standing in the way of what I want to get done here. So, sadly, I'm going to have to attack my Marines. <laughs> Shouldn't say mine. It's not like I own them. Um, what does this guy look like anyway? His morale is actually... His entrenchment's unbelievable. His morale is not as good as I thought it would have been. Oof. Nope, it's not what I wanted. Dang nibbit. What am I doing? That was a mistake. Uh, okay. Great. Yeah, I... I, these guys, whoa, man, both of these guys are in bad shape. This breaking through stuff is uh, costly. Hey, it actually kind of sort of worked. Two to two, that's better. That's even better. We'll do that first. Um, we'll pull back. Pull you over. Ah! So close! We're gonna do it. Shatter him. And see where this takes us. Oh boy. 
All right, we're going to reinforce you. If they move forward, they're just really driving themselves into a trap. So, you know, let them come. Uh, but they've still got their artillery. No, they don't. He's... So we had more America. We got two. And these guys both have. These guys are both gunned up. This guy, the Marines here, the Fourth Brigade, is all by it. it it's not. They they didn't give it any extra. You know, power there. That's just really mean of them to do that. And they're going to pay for it right now. Um. Boom. Can you swap? Ooh, I probably shouldn't, but I'm going to. Can't move anymore. Let's do that. Let's... Yeah, let's put you here. You are going to come down here. Setting up our artillery to strike. Uh, we're done as soon as we can, when we can. Um, he's got 10 shells already. That's interesting. Did you? You did not. Neither did you. Uh, let's see if we can't. You know, I would think, though, it'd be better. Let's look at the. Well, we've got that guy there. That guy there. Yeah. Up. Ooh. Holy smokes! Whew. Two to five, four to six. Two to five gets it. This may not come out quite that good. It didn't. Ah, curse you, artillery, evil, vile. Curse of my life. Take him on. Oh no! No! Are you kidding? I can't get him out of there. Wow, that's bad. Ooh, that was just a really bad idea. Exceptionally bad, even for me. Let's see. Ooh, we can upgrade. What can we upgrade you to? Uh, yeah, that actually be, might be helpful. Okay, so... Except this guy's there. I mean, we can damage them, but the problem is we're damaging ourselves in the process. Um, yeah. Let's go ahead and get these guys. Fixed up here. Time to get these guys upgraded. Maybe they'll do a little better in the fighting if they're actually... Nope. Um... You know, higher along on the fighting ability. Here we go. Okay. Ah, uh, man. You know what I think we're going to do, though, is we're going to look for guys that are in pretty good shape, like you. I thought you were on a rail line. It looks like to me you're on a rail line. But apparently you're not on a rail line. Uh, because I can't operate, which we'll do next turn for this guy. I thought I could operate these guys, but maybe not. You can operate, but you're not in as nearly as good a shape as I wanted. Oh, well. Look at that. We can get him all the way there. <laughs> sure, I'll do that. Uh, boy. Okay. Um, if only I had, could strike this guy with artillery, but I can't. Uh, what is really important for us to hit here? Can't reach him, so it's him. Or it's him. So you're not really set up to hit any of these. Let, let's get rid of this guy. Okay. 
Nice. Okay, we're gonna do this even though it hurts my morale a little bit. Still in good sh one to one. Wow, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Yes! Beautiful. Really? Seriously, you can't? Okay, the Germans will take that. You'll get reinforced. Um, boy. Well, let's reinforce. We can't do anything else here. Let's send the tanks into battle against the cavalry. Boom. And they don't strike twice. Isn't that just too bad? That is too bad. Let's put you right here. That should slow them down. Ugh, artillery! Car size. I can't reinforce. How much? Three? That's worth it. Um, yeah, so, well, I could put him there. Let's go ahead and do that. I don't know that I want to do that. Shh, supply is 11. <laughs> what? Uh, okay. Wow. Um, okay. Okay, there doesn't seem to be any partisans here, so I can't move him either. Ugh. All right, that's it. Let's go ahead and let the AI run see what we can do here hopefully next turn if we could get Cairo next turn that would be awesome okay yes we know about the blockade we have heard of it how low does the French morale get before they just quit I mean they're at two right two percent <laughs> it's like amazingly low oh, hello Really? Wow, they really walloped me. Oh, I should have done something there. Duh. Too late now. Great, lost the ship. That's just spiffy. Uh oh. So long. Dag nabbit. Here they come. They're to. Ooh. Is that a... What is that? That's not a troop transport, is it? No. Is it a carrier? A float plane carrier? Whatever they call them? I'll give, the, I'll give them this. They're, they're trying to fight for... Ugh, every inch. Yeah, they're going to dig in and try and hold. <clears throat> that's, that's bad news for us. I was hoping they'd be in the mood to run. But apparently not yet. Not yet. Jeez. 
Every time I go into action against their fighters, man, they just kick my butt. Every single time. I wonder what the... I haven't... They must, must have a higher level than I do on fighting. Fighters. So, he took a ton of losses. Ouch. Yeah, gonna go after my cavalry. It's a good call. Oh man, I hate that artillery position's just annoying me. And doing serious damage to my unit, I might add. Oh boy. He's gonna wipe him out. No, he held on. Oh, good job there, buddy. Good. Uh oh. That, nope, he did it. Let's see who else they're gonna bring up. Yeah, that's. Yeah. But we weakened all of them, and that's good. And they've got that. Ooh. In that port now, they've got cavalry, not infantry. That's. Oh boy. Yeah, we're almost done here. I don't think I've had enough turn left to get to Paris. Doggone it. Wow, that was some kind of weird noise. Hey, it's a sub. Now that, that is an American troop transport, isn't it? I'm betting it is. Are they gonna try to invade? Well, that would not be good. <laughs> Don't invade Sicily. Come on. Actually, there's really well, we don't want him in Pamplona. That's a national morale objective. And so Syracuse. So, okay, so that would be a serious problem. Um, okay, are we done here? France surrenders! Oh, ho, ho, ho! Woohoo! France surrendered, and I didn't even get to take for done. And we are the great liberators now, liberating North Africa to the hails of the grateful populace. Miners, yeah, I'm sure they do. Central Powers, major victory, people. Whoa. Check it out. We ended the war early. Whoa. Now let's take a look and see what they had back whoa okay no wonder they surrendered Whew. yeah they were in worse shape than i thought and of course the french is that we don't know how many french units they had because they all disappeared um but uh there you go so we won kind of happened i i was actually thinking we might knock the uk out first but we didn't it's over. We want to look at the MPP. Look at this. They had 356. The French, but that's probably because they surrendered first. They have zero. But look at, oh, look at this. Over 1,000, over 2,600. Oh, my goodness. Look at all that. And now, let's just see. Oh. Okay, that's Armored Cruiser. That's a light cruiser. Okay, so it wasn't a troop transport. And down here, yeah. Darn, so close. It would have been a tough fight, but his his, his supplies low. We would have gotten them, I think. How many shells? No, no shells. Well, maybe not. Um, but we had these guys. I think we would have gotten them. Well, that's it. I'm, like, stunned. I thought I had another two or three or four turns left, but no. 
the French surrendered and the British followed suit and that's it. That's all she wrote. There's another British armored unit. So, um, wow, I'm so like caught off guard. I have nothing to say. <laughs> uh, what a heck of a game though. Wow. I, I enjoyed this a lot. So here's what we're going to do. What we're going to do is I believe it's next week. Cause I think, yeah, next week we will start another strategic command world war one game, of course, but this time from the allied side and we'll see how well we do. Lots of challenges there, lots of uh, advantages, but also a lot of disadvantages. And of course, the big thing is, you know, trying to keep the Russians in the war, so which is not going to be easy. So we will try that. One of the things I, I've sworn to myself to do is we will play the uh, Entente as historically as I can. It doesn't mean I'm not going to do anything ahistorical or unhistorical, but I'm not going to do something like invading Belgium. If the AI, which I'm sure they will invade Belgium, but if they don't, I'm not going to. Because there is no way you can convince me historically that would have happened. So there's just no way. I'm trying to see, like, if the United States, we have dreadnoughts and ships here. I don't see any other troops, though. They really didn't have anything? There's, oh, there's a bunch here. Are those the transports? There we go. So here was the second wave of U.S. troops that were coming. All right. Well, guys, that's it. I hope you enjoyed this as much as I did. It feels weird to be ending Strategic Command World War One and my Strategic Command World War Two game playthrough series at pretty much the same time, but there you go. But uh, we did it, so there you go. So thanks so much for watching. Let me know what you think down below in the comments. And uh, we will, like I said, be coming at this from the other side next. So stay tuned for that. If you enjoyed this, please give the video a like. Give my channel a subscribe, which would be great. And if you could share this video, that would be amazing. We've just managed now after three and a half, three and, three and three quarters years to climb our way over 700 subscribers. Let's keep pushing. We'd love to get to that thousand mark someday soon so until then this is the wargaming guy saying thanks for watching take care out there and i will see you later